Peep this out guys, it's Ian K back again with another one for you. This time headed into KFC to check out the latest regional flavor of their chicken that just went national. That's right guys, we've already gotten hot in Nashville and golden in Georgia and now we're headed to the Carolinas to get smoky with the all new Smoky Mountain Barbecue. So let's hit that drive through and set ourselves up. Hi, welcome to KFC. Would you like to try $70 for Uh, you know, actually no, but peep this out. Let me go for that new Smoky Mountain Barbecue combo with an unsweetened tea and that'll be it. Do you want the two piece um, chicken or the three piece tenders? Uh, let's go with the, uh, the tenders. Three piece tenders, okay. Anything else? That's it. So I got um, three piece tender with the smoky barbecue and with that sweet and icy. Go ahead, just pull through in the first one. Great, thanks. So I'll make sure to link my KFC playlist in the upper right hand corner of your display if you want to see those other two reviews that I did. And if this one is half as good as those, we're in for a big treat right now. Hey. Hi, so I got three piece tender with the... Uh, Smoky barbecue and with the uh, unsweetened tea with that. And those are 650 shirts. Okay. Awesome. Thanks so much. We'll see ya. Bye. All right, guys. So it's third time a charm here at KFC. Let's peep this out. The flavors of the South continue here at KFC with the third variation this time, guys. Feast your eyes on the Smoky Mountain Barbecue Crispy Tenders. And right off the bat, a very strong aroma of very rich, smoky smelling barbecue sauce on top of some pickles. I gotta say the pickle aroma is coming through loud and clear as well with only two of them on top. But as you can see, we've got three crispy tenders here, breaded up to a nice golden brown, 100% white meat chicken. And uh, the sauce, I gotta say, glistening in the sun there, looks very appealing. Apparently this has got inspiration from the Carolinas as well as Memphis. So we're gonna get maybe a little touch of vinegar and apparently some extra flavor and crispness that should satisfy the Memphis dry rub fans out there. But I have to say, just alone on the presentation, guys, it looks very appealing, very similar to the Nashville hot chicken and the Georgia gold. And of course, you've got that trademark biscuit on the side. Combo here for $4.99 comes with your cookie as well as a side. Mashed potatoes and gravy is what I went for, but this is the main event, guys. We're gonna focus on this. It's the all new Smoky Mountain Barbecue Crispy Tenders here at KFC. Let's peep out this flavor. The aroma is real on this one, guys. It definitely smells smoky and it looks super, super crispy here. And as you can see, the slice of the pickle that they give here covers a good chunk of the chicken as well. Let's do this. It's the all new Smoky Mountain Barbecue Crispy Tenders here at KFC. Mmm. Lost a little piece of pickle in that first bite, but I gotta tell you what's more distracting is the overall strong smoky barbecue flavor that this sauce actually has, guys. On top of the crispness of the chicken, you instantly get it there. It is very, very flavorful and obviously very crispy. I'm going in again. Let's get this one dressed with a little piece of that pickle that got away, guys. As you can see, 100% white meat chicken on this one, surrounded by a very decent amount of coating. The meat to coating ratio is not too bad. I'd probably say maybe 50-50, it's about even. And definitely the flavor is absolutely there. It starts off a little sweet and then falls back into a nice smoky flavor and then you can really just taste the chicken itself. Not as super flavorful as the Georgia Gold in my opinion, but it definitely nails the smoky name and that is the major highlight of this one by far on top of just the juiciness of the chicken. Pretty well done so far. Let me get a little bit more of this sauce from the bottom and see if we can really taste it a little bit further. Mmm, there it is. You know, I gotta say the experience is just a little bit different after you take that first bite. When you dip it into the sauce in the very bottom of the tray, the flavor seems to stand out just a little bit more, almost like a salad type of dressing there. The vinegar is a little bit more apparent, and I'm really digging the fact that the crispiness of the coating really soaks it up nicely. But again, the highlight is easily gonna be the smoke. They absolutely nail that. One more shot of this one, guys. A very nice addition to the KFC menu with their flavors of the South here. I gotta say, very sizable in terms of the portion size for these chicken tenders. Nice and crispy, nice and golden. I only wish that I actually had one more pickle to go with the third strip here, guys. KFC, you definitely gotta fix that. But as it stands, a very, very solid flavor, very smoky and absolutely satisfying. But naturally, this is all just my opinion based upon my first experience having the latest flavor of the South on the menu here at KFC. But what do you guys think? Do you think this new flavor can hold a candle to the Nashville hot chicken as well as my all-time favorite Georgia Gold? That's really the question, but then again, everybody's tastes are different. But drop some comments down below, definitely let me know. And as for the overall rating, I'm gonna have to give the Smoky Mountain Barbecue Crispy Tenders here at KFC a solid eight and a half out of 10. Well, I don't think this one overtakes Georgia Gold only because that one just had a stronger, richer flavor that kind of stayed consistent throughout. This one is just more of a smoky accent with a little light barbecue sauce thrown into the mix. And the flavor itself just kind of subsides a little bit as you eat it there. So it's not nearly as strong as Georgia Gold in my opinion, much less Nashville hot, but still very, very tasty 
and easily recommended. And those are my thoughts on the latest here at KFC as we close out another episode of Peep This Out, guys. And like I always say, I've got brand new content every single week here on my channel. So while you stay tuned for the next review coming real soon, in the meantime, stay frosty. And KFC, if I can just remind you one more time, please, please, please add some more pickles to the mix with this one because the acidity, snap, and crunch adds so much to these. Two pickles with three tenders is no bueno. One more pickle more, please. All right, guys, until next time, I'll talk to you soon.